Automotive lamps go through many temperature changes in a day, which cause internal pressure changes. This is why vents are needed on lamps to equalize pressure. Automobiles are often exposed to water and common fluids, such as car wash and wax solution. Vents should breathe and equalize pressure even when exposed to these common fluids. Lamp manufacturers and car makers have different choices in vents, such as the blue cap vent shown here or an all-membrane vent made by Gore. We are measuring the internal pressure or vacuum of these fog lamps with the different types of vents mounted on each. The large chart shows pressure trends of each fog lamp over time. The red line shows the cap vent lamp, and the blue line shows the Gore all-membrane vent lamp pressure. The bar charts on the right side of the screen show the instantaneous pressure of each lamp at the present time. We turn on both fog lamps for about 70 minutes to see what happens to the internal pressure when the lamps are heating up. Fog lamps, such as the ones shown here, can get very hot due to their small size. This can cause damage or leakage from the high pressure or vacuum if the vent is not adequate. As the lamps heat up, both vents relieve the pressure that is built up inside back to zero. Next, we will see what happens when we spray a common car wash solution on the fog lamps. This is similar to washing a car after a drive. The sprayer dispenses the recommended ratio of soap to water at the nozzle. After we turn off the lamps, we spray for four minutes with the soap solution. If the vents are still breathing, we should not see much vacuum building up in the lamps. As can be seen on the bar chart, there is a vacuum forming inside the cap vent lamp. After the end of the four minute spray, we continue to look at the lamp internal pressures. As the lamps continue to cool, the vacuum in the cap vent lamp increases to almost 3.5 psi or 24 kilopascals. The vacuum in the lamp with the Gore all-membrane vent is small and quickly goes back to zero. This high level of vacuum continues in the cap vent lamp for about 23 minutes before it finally releases. This high vacuum level can easily cause lamp damage or water leakage into the lamp through the seals. Here is the overall pressure plot for both lamps during the heating and cooling cycles. The Gore all-membrane vent clearly performs better at venting pressure in a lamp through common soap and water exposure, such as during a car wash.